Hello, Cyclone members, and it's me, Raven here, back again with another video. And today, we are here to do Yar. <laughs> the, I, I don't even know, it's Yar quest, okay? So, I'm gonna show you how to do the Yar quest, okay? This is kind of sounding awkward, so I'm just gonna call it the pirate quest now. A black flag flies on the horizon. Are pirates headed for home base? All right, let's check it out. All right, team. Do not be alarmed, but we have just received the following bottled memorandum. Oh. Attention, Greater Stone Plank and Twine area. Cower mm. in fear. We be coming for ye treasures. Yours uh. in plunder. Blakebeard and Keelhall. I like he meant Blakebeard. Oh, yes. This is good news to you? Oh no, mm. we are in terrible danger. But the more you say that, bro. you built a robot that will solve one infinitesimally small part of the problem. Yes. A black flag flies on the horizon. Our pirates headed for home base. Stand by to deploy our state-of-the-art pirate detection system. So we have to deploy pirate sea box in every in any zone so i guess for uh to play safe here i might just go to these venture cells right here oh man i really like the island on here for this man man this actually kind of looks pretty cool not gonna lie so i'm gonna do the level freeze first if your venture level has been reset it because you know each uh you know event happens like a quest event and stuff like that happens and they're going like reset your venture level so you have to rebuild that thing back up again so Sadly, I have to rebuild this back up again, but for sure, if you're like level one or you're not like level three, I'm just doing the three islands, but I go with the survivors first because it's not like you got to defend the van or like the atlas and all that stuff. It's just you saving survivors, so it should be easy. Here we go. One of the pirate sea bots, right? All right, no, that's just the shrubs that we had to destroy. Okay, this should be the sea bot right here. Right here, you guys got to look for this. Oh, I like the theme here. Yo, I'm on the PS5 and all this looks so cool. PS5 graphics on Save the World is actually insane. Let's do it. Hey. Alright, here we go. Another pirate sea bot to rescue. But first, we gotta kill these scally axe. Man, why is this not giving me like One Piece vibes for real? You could move on to Robotics Manual Volume 2. There's a Volume 2? Homebase has 55 volumes and enough components on hand to build thousands of powerful robots. Ranging okay. from Lesson 1, the humble Seabot, to Lesson 500, the giant mm. storm fighting Mecha Master Bot. Oh, okay. So that's what those parts were for. What do you mean, were for? You know what happened. Don't make me say it out loud. Guys, I don't know what's going on, but I'm like extremely laggy, bro. Laggy Save the Ward gameplay is it because the PS5 can't handle Save the Ward, bro. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. To my annual Where getting to know you home base survey, okay. we have some highly experienced piracy experts right here at home base. Mm -hmm. A statistically impossible number of counter piracy experts, actually. Oh, Almost every okay. single person at home base is a piracy expert. Okay. Now we're talking. Let's assemble the pirate fighting squad. Yep, I'm getting everyone in here. <laughs> I are you saying the same thing? According to the Getting to Know You survey, you are an expert in counter piracy. Yeah, uh, that was a joke. Jokes are funny, Bruh. Kyle. All right, let's just move on to the next expert. Sarah, we need your pirate fighting expertise. I have no clue what you're talking about, Riggs. That's okay. I'm sure someone took the survey seriously. Keep up the good work. Surely you wouldn't use an official home base form as an opportunity to tell a joke. If you're referring to where I wrote in, yes, please. That was not a joke. No? Question 57. On a scale of 1 to 10, rate the following statement. I am a scourge of the seven seas and inspire fear in the hearts of stout seafaring scoundrels. You answered 12, 
witch. Judging by your smirk, you must think this very funny. <laughs> Guilty. I see pirates. Are you sure? see some pirates? A pirate is crazy? Decided to lie on question 57. So, mm. here we are, waiting to be attacked by pirates. Um, mm -hmm. is it me, or are you starting to sound just like Ray? It's you. It's all of you. This is what constant low grade disappointment and frustration gets to a person. She's mm. not wrong. Mm. Guess what? I see pirates. Pirates are closing in. Mm -mm. Attention pirates. Reverse course immediately, you will be in violation of home based anti piracy policy. Sorry, we didn't know you had a policy. Nothing to worry about, but now you know. This is so embarrassing. We honestly had no idea. These things happen. Just reverse course. I hate to ask, but can you give me and Kiel's a minute to talk over our plans? Granted. Thank you so much. We had planned on terrorizing your people and looting your treasures. Burning, pillaging, mayhem. But rules are rules. Mm. Oh, yeah. Rules are rules. Yep. Okay, for another course of the pirate quest, we have this. The pirates has crashed. Let's disarm their ship before they have a chance to attack. So we gotta neutralize the pirate threat. So I'm thinking we may have a boss fight with Blackbeard, like, you know, the one that we have in season eight of chapter one. So yeah, I think we'll go have that. So this is what you guys gotta do. And I'm gonna make a kind of a walkthrough for it and stuff. Why would you do mm -hmm. such a thing? Why would you go across the street? Mm-hmm. Okay, so let me guess, we're gonna face a bunch of pirates here that's gonna kill us, right? Oh, okay. Okay, look, we got an island here. I never see a raptor swimming in the lake before, but that's kind of creepy now, not gonna lie. Now that wildlife's been introduced to Save the World, man, it's, Save the World's not been the same since then. I mean in the good way, honestly, because I remember there was no wildlife here. We had to do our hoverboards from ability. Oh, what's gonna happen? Oh, shoot! Okay, that was low. Head to the cove. Okay, we gotta find the cove, guys. So, n for now, you guys have to miss locate the pirate ship that's been crashed, and hopefully, my laggy. Internet will stop lagging. Oh, this must be the cover, right? Here we are, the pirate suit. Why are you call it Exe? It's EXE. Okay, here we are, guys. So this is what we gotta do here. It's like I'm looking at a boat, but almost every other time I look at a boat, I'm not bored. In fact, mm. I love it, and I think I suddenly love crime. This is a pirate ship. That explains it. Oh, I should have been a pirate. Let's go check yep. it. Yep. We may have to mm -hmm. build our way over to the ship. Yeah, we already did that. We already did that. <laughs> I'm on the ship right now. Disarm. Okay, now we all have to disarm the ship. 
I guess we gotta get really good there. We'll sort this out. Until then, let's all just deal with one problem at a time. Collect cannon. Okay, here, we gotta collect the cannons before they actually shoot. So now, what we gotta do is collect some of these cannons so they can't shoot anymore. Also, you guys may wanna get these cannonballs because these guys give you some minerals, by the way. That's sort a of tip there for what you're in adventure. You know, just a little tip there. I may do an actual review on the Miss Bunny Penny skin after this video, so yeah. Ooh, we'll hide this. Okay, we gotta hide this thing. Okay, so we gotta hide it around uh, a hole right here. I think around that location there. I wish I could get my marker there, but whatever. Well, there's a teammate here with me, and he's planting down all the bombs here, or the cannons basically. So I think now we have to defend this against the husk now. So uh, we gotta build around this place pretty sure. So I'm pretty sure when we place down these cannons, we gotta build around them, you know, keep them safe from the husk, cause I, I'm definitely sure the husk are definitely going to, uh, pretty much, uh, attack these cannons. Hold on, me, hold on, Mike. The last one. The cannons are safely hidden. Job well, and we've got Mm-hmm. Yep, so we'll defend. Good thing I got some good old guns here. Okay, there the we go. Have been yep. The remaining husks are heading for the power ship. Oh, the are not going to like that. <laughs> we won't. You send husks to my ship, I will bury you. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good at all. Alrighty, here we are. Alright, let's see. Okay, look, I got my special daily quest here. I will bury you like treasure, and then I'm gonna forget where I buried you. Just like the treasure I lost. Why didn't you make a map? You can't make a map, dummy. Let's <laughs> come from the store. Oh, man. This I'm is rich. A good pick. You can't go wrong with a classic. Hey! Mm. <sighs> they're, they're making off with our ship. Ooh, mm. having a pirate ship could come in handy. Take out any ship-stealing mist monsters you find. We better search the wreckage for Blakebeard and Keelhaul. They may be pirates, but they're still our responsibility. Okay, now we got shipwrecked. Don't let the mist monsters make off with Blake, Blakebeard and Kelhaul's pirate ship. Oh my god, that was a mouthful. Find ship parts by eliminating mist monsters in any zone. All right, here we gotta eliminate. Okay, so these are the mist monsters. So these mist monsters are here. Do I come to your work and slap the parrot off your shoulder? I don't do 
Why would you slap a parrot? Then don't tell me how to pirate. You ass. Oh, pirating Netflix shows? Yo, I do. No, I'm good. Oh, she saw a rocket like that. Yo, I like that. Final one we gotta select, and now we basically done that mission. I have a proposition for the two of you. Uh, I may have installed some ransomware on the home base network, which will delete all of our files very soon. So if you help mm -hmm. us find enough treasure to pay off our ransomware debt, we'll help you get back on your feet. I don't hate this plan yet. I have some reservations. But there are conditions. No pillaging, no looting, no mm -hmm. rain the terror. <laughs> mm. ah, that's a good one. But really, what are the conditions? No pillaging, no looting, no rains of terror. Pass. Hard pass. Rock hard pass. Frankly, we're insulted by the offer. Another one down. Ray, what are we gonna do with these pirates? We can't just set them loose on the world. Yeah, and we really, really need their help finding treasure. What do you want to do, Commander? Blackbeard jumping in here for a second. Do you not have a secure comm channel? We use the honor system. <laughs> you use the, uh, honor system? Okay. Now I understand your ransomware problem. Okay, hopefully my microphone... Does it sound like home base needs us more than we need them? That's what it sounds like to me. Then maybe they can help us find the map to Rowdy Jack's treasure. Sure, mm -hmm. but the no reign of terror policy is... Uh, honor system? This is a private conversation. I was offering to help. Mm -hmm. Honor system! What does it mean? Fine. Bye. Okay, that was very toxic. Okay. Now, we have to search for ancient, uh, Plank Stone Stonehead for I don't even know how to say that, but I'm pretty sure it's in any zone. So, what does it say? Stone face. Uh, the treasure hunt is on. Search ancient Plank Den. I don't know, Stoneheads. Plank Stoneheads for clues. So, yeah, now we have to find this around here. I think this is, um, Venture. So, I think you will pick Venture. Just to be safe. Like an easy, and that's how you say it. Okay. Okay, so we gotta find these things right here. Examine the statue, the Moa. They're not Plankinezas, bro. They're like Moa, like the Moa emoji. The Moa, bro. Get it right. Does this place remind you of anything? Scurvy Rogers last stand. Can you guys not hear me? I, I don't think they do. So what are we waiting for? Let's find some friggin' statues. Okay, All right. I guess we are looking for statues. Yep, we're looking for Moa's boys. Yep, and I can hear the excitement in the voice. It's just crazy. This is giving One Piece vibes for real. I was just watching One Piece like last week, bro. Nice work. Add Blue Glow to the Atlas. Open mission control when you're ready to begin. Nothing. This must not be the statue. Do we have anything more to go on? There could be hundreds of statues around here. Uh, let me see here. The statue was friendly. Yar! With a song in its heart and a great hunger in its belly. Can we at least just focus on the hungry looking statues? Nope. No map. So these not at all convincing clues we're following are from your father? Was he a treasure hunter? My father was Blake Jennings Sr.? Okay. I'm gonna get the name when you got the name from. Uh, Blake Jennings Sr. The inventor of the sun-dried tomato. 
they pretty much dominated the 90s. But even though he had more money than he could spend in a thousand lifetimes, he only cared about Rowdy Jack's treasure. Everything and everyone else came second to that treasure. So you know it has to be important. He couldn't find it, but we will. So, are you sure Rowdy Jack is real? I've gone through all of Dad's research. He's real. She's a cartoon. And follow-up question. Are you real, Pirates? How dare you? How dare you offend them, bro? They all real pirates. They don't talk like pirates. They just don't listen to their heart. I am talking like a pirate, okay? Everything I say is what a pirate would say. How a pirate would say it. Because I am a pirate. No, I really do sound like it, don't worry. No! I take it back pirate culture from people like you. Everything I'm saying right now, this is how a pirate talks. Okay, this is the final stone head we gotta find. Even though I'm certain that Rowdy Jack the one-eyed pirate is entirely fictional, it must be exciting following the path of your dad's research. I guess. But I was sort of expecting it to feel more special. Like I would just know, you know? How so? I just expected to look around and be like, wow, that's where Jack fought the cannibals. Yeah, and whoa, that's where they buried the leftovers of first mate Smitty. But instead, I just feel uncertain. I don't believe it. Look! <laughs> we found it. We found it! Go. All right, since you completed this quest, you should get no This is also not a map. It's gibberish. Written on the back of a diner placemat. Classic Rowdy Jack subterfuge. Well played, sir. This is obviously a code. Oh, Ray, Ray, Ray! Yes, Dennis, we have pirates now. Then I declare Sea Feast! What is Sea Feast? Bring me grills! Okay, now we have to do this. Fate has called upon Dennis to craft the most ultimate pirate burger, but is he ready for the challenge? Collect growth plates for Dennis from mostly in suburban and lakeside zones. Three, two, one, go. Okay, guys, so now we gotta find more of these grills things around here that Dennis is talking about. So we'll go right here and we find an oven. So you guys will have to break into ovens and get these grill pods here because this guy's trying to make a feast. We gotta find eight. Yeah, grill parts. So this should be easy because it's in every house, and I should strongly suggest Sorbirds because there's like a bunch of houses around here, but everything has a grill. So basically, you get this done in one mission, like no problem needed, like no no challenge needed. Basically. Bro, stop being a spoiled brat, dude. Oh my God, I like how Dennis is just turning into a spoiled brat, like the second it goes. When we get into this mission, like we first just started this mission, and now this guy's like talking about, I need more parts, I need more money, I need more premium stuff, I need prime. Like, bro, such a goofy stuff, bro. No, try again. Whoa, Dennis, mm -hmm. what's going on, buddy? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Pirates, Ray. True. I'm just under a lot of pressure, okay? Okay, you don't have to feel like you're under a lot of pressure. Bro's getting heated up about this. Yeah, man. Okay, so that's all the grill parts you guys have to basically find. And you have to destroy the ovens. Oh, I just love the commentary of my Raven hero. No one cares about quality. Dennis, you're just gonna have to do the best you can with what we find. There is a symphony of beef in my mind, Ray. Arias of melted cheese, harmonious concertos of bib lettuce and heirloom tomato. But I'm creating on a busted piano. Literally, my grill is a busted piano. Target located. Drop the atlas on the target when you're ready. I know you're upset, 
And I know this won't matter, but everyone at home base loves your burgers. Not like they have another option. Could cheer you up to tell me about the pirate burger you'd make if you could? Wait, a pirate burger you make? Come on, give it a try. Perfect pack of eggs. Celebration of the sea, a Weird. turbulent, stormy, infinite. The flavor would be an unplaceable, savory, umami wave, strong enough to drown the saltiest sailor, but benevolent mm -hmm. enough to deliver lost swimmers to further. There's an atlas in this house. Worst place to put an atlas. Period. Try it. They hire me on the spot, and we sail the seven seas forever. Oh, thanks, Ray. Don't be mad, but I invited Keelhaul and Blakebeard over to your place for burgers tonight. What, 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 what? I'm not ready! Yes, you are. And they've been living on limes and stale bread for the last month. Trust me, you're gonna blow their minds. Here you go, Dennis's pirate burger. Sorry it's not better. Oh my god, what's wrong with you? Honestly, I can just smack you in the face. Mm. <laughs> just throw them in the garbage. In fact, throw me in the garbage. Aww. Tommy, this is the best burger I've ever had in my life. It's like a celebration of the friggin' ocean, and you're over here apologizing? Oh, this is so good. It makes me regret stealing so much stuff from home base. Mm. I regret burying everything we stole. Tell me you made more. No more burgers until we get our stuff back. Alright. Now we have to dig up everything Blake Bear and Callie Ha has stolen from home base so we can find cassettes in any zone. So I don't know what they look like, but I'm pretty sure it'd probably be like treasure chests or bags or something like that. Okay, you know what? Ah, uh, here he is. Yep. Right around here. Thank you, Callie Ha. Yeah, I pronounced your name right. I'll take piracy goes like that. Go. Okay, now we thanks to my generous teammate, I actually found some more of these catches. Honestly, my teammate is just the goat. Like literally. They have the goat. Honestly, probably just leave it. But that was before we tried Dennis's burger. Oh uh, what this cat says? Is it dog poop? I just love how the characters are talking, I'm just bashing skulls, hustling uh, skulls on the go. Okay, we got another catch to find. One of them actually, that's dug up here. Not to give you advice, but nothing you've stolen here is valuable. Yeah, bro, all you stole was dog poop. <laughs> Ooh, but you did steal this. Ayo, hey, this is the golden... Alright, here we go. The final catching. I was unaware you could make those. But yeah, that makes sense. Oh, well, we got all the catches now, guys. Go. Alright, this is the last one. I was wrong of the first the one. one. Yeah. Round, round two. Round two of what? Oh. Okay, now we must continue on to Yard to doing more Yard quests. I don't make it. Oh, you guys are still making burgers? Even though they stole from me? Uh huh. Oh, shoot, sure, I got the worst one. I gotta make it out. I gotta come out. Outlander. The challenge. Okay. Is this where we should start digging? Digging? Yep. What? No, no. No? Then why did you send us here? That note you sent? It decrypted into multiple sets of coordinates and a clue. And I quote, Light the lamps for all to see, and then thar the treasure be. Lamps? <laughs> Guess we should get to those coordinates and see what we find. Alright, light stone beacons to continue the search for Rowdy's Jack's treasure. Light the stone beacons. This is gonna be like a run on the floor. Look at that. Light the lamps for all to see. And oh, the treasure beacons. 
Oh, is the treasure all the way in a storm? Don't, don't think so. Must point toward Jack's treasure when they're all lit. Awesome. Mm. I prefer oh, what you call them, Yes, your point still stands. Eagle eye. Send the next coordinates our way. Eagle eye. Let's do it. Now. Attached image. Ignore that. That's personal. Hey yo, what's personal? Is it your OnlyFans password or something? On the date, the balloon when is going? Okay, I see what you mean. Uh, I think we got about like five. Can you believe it? Yeah, I know. Right. Okay, we're having one percent into this. Well, uh, let me just become a complete menace by not helping out this device. Would I finally be enough? I don't know you well enough for this. Oh, dang. Do you, do you want those next coordinates? For the love of all that is good and holy, yes, please, Eagle Eye. Yeah, please, Eagle Eye. Actually, give up, please. Like, actually, give us the coordinates, you stupid woman. Yo ho ho, another beacon. Yar! Shiver my timbers. And, uh, Shiver my timbers. Sounds like something a British person would say. No okay, cap, bro. And I have very accountants with a bunch of British people, especially one that starts with the R and has Renegade and has the last name of the Renegade Raider. Okay, well now we gotta find the next coordinate, and I don't know where it's the next coordinate because I have to go into another freaking mount in order to finish this. Oh, we found two of these guys right here. Oh, I'm mm -hmm. gonna go make a big beacon to where it is on this map right now. Bro, I'm just destroying this mo of voice. Like, this mo of face right now. I'm just destroying it. <laughs> Alright, where is it at? You hear that, you salt covered scamps? We found you. Oh, I can build faster. Let's go. Someone got a boost. Let's do this. Okay, now the tre the prize have found the treasure, so now let's go. Alrighty, now we got done with another set of yore. Now, what do we need to do? It's so friggin' cool! Let's get digging! Yeah! Yeah! Why does that sound so sarcastic in there? my dad's work, me and Keels, and an assortment of heavily armed strangers with me to do it. Couldn't have done it without you guys. Yar, Blake. Yar. Yep, yar too. Here it is. Keels, do you want to do the honors? 
you do it. You've earned it. No, you earned it. Are we really not getting Why don't credit? both of you just open it? It's not that hard. So I guess I'll have to argue who's get to open it first. Okay, this is it. Search the zone to find Rowdy's Jack's treasure. Find the treasure. You might find it in any zones. We're opening it together. What is it? It's the treasure! It's the super secret treasure! Yeah. You all ready? And three, two, one, open! Alright, did the countdown. Get out of the great Blake Beard. The heck? I regret sharing this moment. Avoid geocaching enthusiast. He found Rowdy Jack's treasure. Good work. Please rebury the prize for the next round of adventurers. Another adventure in a treasure chest. All right, let's see what we got here for that disappointing treasure chest missing that we did. It was so disappointing. But you know what I got from that treasure? Some Peaky Sparks! Yeah, queen! Okay, that was kind of strange for me to bring that. For 25 consecutive years! For geocaching?! Herbert Brian was right! Our family is the toxic garbage barge! But we mm. succeed! No one leaves! This secret dies with all of us! Quickly, uh -oh. back to base! That's not good. Now that we've all cooled out and agreed that no one is killing anyone. For the tenth mm -hmm. time, yes. Maybe we can see this not as a failure, but as a chance to do better. Oh. Much better. And very, very quickly. I cannot overstate how much we need treasure. There is, uh, just one problem. We both get really, really seasoned. Back when I managed mm -hmm. an astronaut training camp, we used simulators to help our trainees combat motion sickness. Perhaps we could scrounge up the necessary parts to make something similar. Let's mm. see what we can find. Yep, okay. Help Director Riggs build a sea sickness care for Blake Bear and Kelly Ha. Hit springs and swing pods to be found in sub and uh, zones. Galbra springs and swing pods to construct a sea sickness center. No. All right, y'all. We are back in today. We are here to search for some pirate flags so we can get done with this stupid mission. I'm at great mission. Officer of Doom. We got another scenario. Cool. I love scenarios. One guy. Okay, here we are. Alright, here's a second flag here. A small time training vessel returning home from a faraway land. Laden with fragrant spices, lush textiles, exotic oils, and the like. As you sail through a narrow channel, you see an unassuming ship. A friend you wonder to yourself, full of ignorance. Then, it hoists this flag. Announcing its piratey intent. Swashbuckling buccaneers, ready to separate you from your goods, your limbs, and your life. Still think it would look freaking rad on the back of a jeans jacket? No, sir. No, sir. Good. Now let's continue. Okay. All right. Those really getting out playing oh, there. The Jolly Roger, huh? Mighty sweet colors, Miss Emmy. They're not sweet. They're scary. Yeah, the director told us all about how we're supposed to be scared of these flags. Wow, that's the thing. No, no, no. Other people are scared of those flags. You guys are supposed to be doing the scaring. Yeah. Come on, director, mm -hmm. you know that. I suppose you're right. I've been on the defense so long, I've lost sight of our real mission here. Like, King Paul, would you do me the honor of trying again? Laden with spices, oils, textiles. You raise the flag and wave it at them. Point at it dramatically. No! That's when you yell things like Avast! Give us your booty, lest your doom be upon you. Hey yo, Bob. Why? That was pretty good. Hi, devil. Okay, let's try it one last time. Doom be upon you. Okay, 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 I got it. I got it. 
pirates, trade ships, spices, oils, textiles, raise flag and... Yar! Surrender your loot, ye build-sucking scumbag! I'm frightened with notes of insulted. Very nice, Keelhaul. Yeah, very nice, indeed. Guys, we got done with that pirate mission. Now we're in Operation Four. Before we cut you some ribbons. Like Beard, your delivery needs a little more confidence, and I think you meant cut them two ribbons. But I think we can mm -hmm. all agree that you've made amazing progress. Mm -hmm. With a little more work and some superficial adjustments, we'll make scabrous dogs of you yet. Yeah. Whoa! Nice technique. Commander, I'm teaching Blake Beard and Keel Hall about the finer points of shipboarding, the cutlass mm -hmm. arts, etc. If you wouldn't mind, I'd love to have them shadow you. Blake, Keel mm -hmm. Hall, observe the commander's excellent melee technique. Yeah. The swing is graceful like a dancer, but the hit is brutal, like the mm -hmm. biting insult of a hormone choked teenager. Mm -hmm. Hormone choked teenager? Hmm, got it. All right, grab a melee weapon and prepare to demonstrate your swats buckling husk busting skills. Collect melee trophies from husk. And I think that's like eight of them that we have to... Pirates. Y'all, you must die. Why did that sound like I was underwater? Got that one. You're not even paying attention. I thought you were the one who wanted to be a pirate. Director, I just don't see the point of all these uh, exercises and lesson plans. Isn't being a pirate supposed to be more about, like, I don't know, a piratey state of mind or something? You're mm -hmm. thinking of yoga. Piracy is a I lifestyle built on sea crimes and treasure finding. I know you're anxious about finding treasure, Ray, but trust the process. Our little pirates will leave the crew's oh, suit and And when they finally spread their dreaded piratical wings, all the ships at sea will cry out in terror. Is this a bad plan? Considering the circumstances, it's still a bad plan. But as mm -hmm. you always say, a bad plan is still a plan. Sure. He does have a plan. Oh, Hey, yo, it's in the efficiency and excellent use of momentum, but take that talk about blood, bro. Yeah, you made the chill out of there, bro. We don't want you to become the new Jeffrey Dahmer for sure, bro. Okay, I'm trying really hard to pay attention to what you're doing here and like learn or whatever. I'm noticing that when you hit the monster guys, they die. Yes, that's, yeah. that's a good the story. mindless humans. They used to be humans and now they're huh? They okay, don't listen to me. Yeah, put now. them down, you know what yeah. I mean? Plus, they're gonna come back from yeah. the dead, obviously. Like, check this out. Huh? Did you just dab me? Again? Oh, cannibals. Yeah. Oh, shoot. How is he not dead? Target not yet located. How does this make sense? He did not, he did not die. If he got stabbed, Are I mean, you? did he get stabbed? Oh. Okay, Blake. Yeah, just a little winded. And bleeding. Ah, but I'll be okay. As a brief aside, I think we might want to talk about your name, Blake. This is the moment you choose to make fun of my name? Well, it's not very... It sounds a little... It doesn't really evoke... It makes you sound like you're the lead singer of a 25-member freaking music collective. Not precisely how I was going to put it, but... I suppose that logic scales. Yeah, this... I have a hey, feeling he's gonna die. Why not go Blackbeard? It's the Dread Pirate! Blakebeard. Only one pirate could be behind this reign of terror. Blakebeard? Uh, okay. When you put it like that, I can totally see what you mean. Just mm -hmm. something to consider, okay? Yeah. Hello, Commander. You are really on a roll here. Mm -hmm. I'm just too good better. for you, Sadi. Do it again! Alright, bet I'll do it again. I need to find a house first. So I can, like... Slice their organs. I mean, what? Am I becoming Jeffy Dahmer? Guys, Raven Seto becomes Jeffy Dahmer. Gone right off the news at the last one. If I could have a quick private sidebar, 
I just wanted to thank you for your help with all this. Yeah, no problem. Some sort of latent fraternal instincts, or my revulsion at such heinous inefficiency. But there's something about these two that just makes me want to help them. And I really what? appreciate your assistance in their education. Oh, no problem. Let's get back to smashing those husks. Yep, no problem, Director. You're probably one of my most favorite characters in the Save the World crew, or in Home Base, I have Here we are. We got done with some yard quests, and this is like the final part of it for uh, part four, if I'm pretty sure correct. We should have this. Good one. Well, what do you say, my piratey pupils? Are you ready to take up the way of the bludgeon and blade yourselves? Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Aye aye, director! Excellent. Mm -hmm. What about you? The husks will tremble when they hear Blakebeard the Scratchy's on the way. Oh, mm -hmm. you'll get there. One ahoy at a time. So mm -hmm. scratchy. Yep. So wait, why do we need peg legs exactly? Yeah, not to be insensitive, but we've still got all our legs. For now. But statistically speaking, one in three pirates loses at least one leg in their day-to-day -day pirating activities. So, we need to make sure that you are not only prepared for this eventuality, but that you have all the varieties of peg leg that the modern buccaneer requires. Hmm. All right. Blake Bear and Kelly Hobb may have not need peg legs yet, but it never hurts to be prepared. Destroy wooded chairs to harvest peg legs. Collect peg legs from most wooded chairs. Two, one, go. All right, y'all. We got some chairs uh, destroyed. So, what are these then? Peg legs. Peg legs. Never know when you'll need to attend a saltwater soiree or black tie grog tasting. Having a range of peg legs that looks suitable with a tuxedo or cocktail dress is essential for making sure you're not turned away. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it really is, dude. Once you got a peg leg on, you you just absolutely have the riz, bro. As a pirate. Wow, these peg legs look pretty hardcore. Ah, yes, the yeah. stranded no more mountaineer collection, perfect for scaling lofty peaks or long desert hikes. Do pirates really end up in those situations very often? What do you think about boulders like? They never announce that they're going to crush your limbs. Well, all right, y'all. Some chairs up here. It's just peg legs. No. I thought you would, Keel Hall. These are your club steppers. Perfect for a night on the town and guaranteed to mm -hmm. hold up while dancing. Mm -hmm. Not the best at climbing downstairs, however. So, always be ready for the drop. Gotcha. Yeah. That's really nice. Yeah. Sounds about right. Buccaneer business casual. Perfect for boarding meetings. Say hello to Blake Beard, terror of the seven seas and inventor of nautical normcore fashion. Precisely. <laughs> Nerds. These ones seem a little boring. Yes, these are your plain jades. It's good to have quite a few of these. For those days that you're pillaging a town and you Yes, the pirate world is quite obsessed with material wealth, Blake. Sometimes you need to look extra fresh to show your foes with whom they're messing. And that means making sure your dead drips accordingly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew that. Yeah, it's just look at her on a mission from my daily quest. That's insane. Yes, it's absolutely impractical and you'll surely never use it. But inevitably, someone is going to ask you if you have a leg gun. And when they do, you don't want to be the only pirate at the round table without a leg gun. A leg gun? Uh, is it like a peg leg with okay, like a pistol or something? This one for? See the knobs and sensible rubber bottom? It's a no-stick peg leg, making sure you don't lose your footing in slippery situations. Oh, yeah, 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 sure, for cooking or mopping. I get it. 
more like when you're boarding a ship whose crew has a reputation for being very full of blood and organs. But my leg is good too. Oh, your very first peg leg collections. They're kind of beautiful all lined up like that. Where are we supposed to keep them? We'll go over a proper procedure for peg leg care and storage later. I've got a pamphlet. Now come on, there's still more to learn. Awesome. Maybe we'll lose our legs so we can start using these. Yay! Okay. Yeah, y'all are gonna lose your legs for free. We're almost out of time to pay off our ransom, so... Stand by for your, potentially literal, final exam. Shipbuilding 101. Okay, walk the plank. Our pirates are ready to take to the seas once more. Help Blinkbeard and Kelly Hall build the pirate ship of their dream. Okay, so this is like the special one right here when it says walk the plank. Uh, it has a story missing like when you see the buck right here. This is one we have uh, missing, the special missing. It's very similar to like, you know, the other event missions we do. And there's like this one special mission that's like missing that has a buck. It's very similar to the one that I did for Fort Nightmares. I think it was like the brainstorm, uh, quests like the brainstorm one i actually really like those quests those quests were not that bad but honestly we're gonna finish up this yar quest today and i'm probably gonna post this video friday because I, I at the time i'm recording this on a sunday night and i have school so i basically probably post this like friday in the morning like first thing in the morning really so let's go ahead and do this okay here we go Search the zone for the Are this not, like pirate ship this Bro, oh, this is like literally like on the 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 forest area, the lakeside Sorry. area, bro. Why why is it similar, to that, bro? Why is it similar to lakeside, bro? This does not look like anything piratey, okay? This does not make any sense. Okay, locate a building site. What about here? This looks like a good building site, really. This looks pretty cool. Build okay. Build a pirate ship. You steal a pirate ship. Uh, fine. This well, is my ship. Bro. Please, no one builds it and steal it! Yeah, yeah, those guys are gonna steal it, we don't know. 2-1 go, this is finally the last piece. Done. Look, we constructed it. We may almost there. Oh my freaking god, okay, here we go. Alright, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank God, please are coming at the flight. Oh, yeah, no problem. Mm-mm. Oh, no. Alt F7. Retreat! Reverse course! Turn her about! Wait, okay. did you know how to do that this whole time? Dang, I didn't know pirates know how to do computers. I didn't know pirates do computers. Yo, this stuff looks cool. Oh my god, look at those, like, graphics on the cannons. Well, they really do look cool. Can now, can this end, please, so I can get on with my day and do some of these quests and finish some of these, please? Thank you very much for this. Oh, thanks for the level 401 anyways, so I'm gonna use it or anything. And also thank you for the 100 V-Bucks, you'll we'll need that from the Goku Black skin. I believe you built the finest ship to ever catch me on. Let's set sail! Yar! I be suddenly noticing we are landlocked. Yar. Yar indeed. Oh look, it's Blake Bear the Black Water. I've been seeing bottles wash up on shore, and I've got a sneaking suspicion they're from Keels and Blakebeard. Mm. Okay, cool. Alright, now, check on- Check in on Blakebeard or Kelly Hall's adventure on the high scenes by collecting bottle messages. Collect messages from bottles. So I guess we gotta go into every zone, I think. Alright, here we go. Yeah, I know, we gotta resupply. Alright, I collected one of the m bottles. Oh, dang, I got a right there. Dear land lovers. Only been back at sea a few days, but it feels like months since you left your shores. Training on the uh -huh. machine is definitely paying up. 
Only throwing up three or four times a day. Big improvement. Deal all wants me to say hi. She's a little laid up right now after picking a fight with a shark. I think she really wants to use those peg legs we picked up. I may have oversold the appeal of peg legs. I won't do it again. Yeah. But it was very cool because the sock pretty much bit off Kelly's leg, I think. It's great, I don't care about your default missing voice. I want to hear messages from you. I want to hear what they say and what they recorded on their inspection. the final part of the mission y'all took us like almost like three weeks to complete this second like, time um... Well, I guess that's the end for now. Anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, post the case, and stay updated with amazing videos just like this. But all that said, have a good day, or a good night, guys. Living, peace, bye.